Hello, hello les potos gamers, c'est chaîne classée, voilà, on est autour de pause. Indien. So what happened with Reed? Well, I finally found the last of the gang hiding in a nearby cave. First, I had to dispatch the lookouts. Je sais pas si le son est encore. Not to let that murderer escape my revenge again. Show him how to die. Wander in willy nilly. I decided it would be better to smoke that some bitch out. Hey, Reed! I shouted. No wonder you're so ornery. Can't be easy being married to Belle Star while you're off providing for the family. She's spreading her legs for every Tom, Dick, and Cole younger. Not an attractive woman exactly, but very friendly. At least she was to me. Son of a bitch! It was then that the last bunch of bandits jumped out of hiding. Why won't this asshole give up? Would someone please get <laughs>
Ils sont dégoûtés, ils arrivent à te mettre des balles. Ils sont plus bien enrochés. Il est pas mal, hein. C'est un petit peu pour eux. Eventually, it was just me and Reed. I had waited a long time to face him down, so I could repay him for what he did to my brothers. Pay him, I did. Change de côté. Si tu en sais pas, descendu. Well, I don't know about you boys, but I'm pretty beat. Well. It's too damn bad you never found that Bob character. Seems a shame he never had to pay. Well, funny thing about that. I did have one more chance at him. Six months ago, I heard that Butch and Sundance were back in the States and had gathered up some of their old gang. I tracked him down, hoping that Roscoe Bob Bryant had returned with him. So, you're saying they didn't die down in Bolivia? That's what I'm saying. Forty years I had waited to get my hands on the last of my brother's killers. Not even an army of demons could have stopped me now. Jim Reed fell fairly quickly, but the last one, Roscoe Bob Ryan, that son of a bitch had managed to escape my vengeance time and time again. I couldn't even be certain I'd recognize him after all those years. By now, he had to be close to 70. But for all you know, he could have been dead. That thought had indeed crossed my mind, as did others.
For instance, did my thirst for vengeance turn me into something worse than the man I was after? By this point in my storied career, I had killed more men than Bob Bryant ever had. I was furious as hell at that bastard for making me who I am. A man with no family, no friends, no purpose except shooting Bob Bryant dead. Stop me from taking his life. I've been after that killer forever. From the time I rode with Billy the Kid. But that chapter of my story you already know. Chapter of that fairy tale, you mean? Suddenly it was 1910. There I was, an old man roaming a ghost town dead almost two decades. Just like me. Quits. My dead brothers were begging me to end what I started so long ago. Mr. Graves, are you all right? Uh, Would you like some water? The wild bunch knew uh, was there. They were after a treasure they had hidden before they fled, buried in the grave of a dead amigo. Some folks think the town is haunted, so they figured there wouldn't be many people poking around. Intended to fill that grave with Bob Bryant's corpse. But like I said, the bandits knew I was on to them. They lured me in, 
and hit me with everything they had. prevailed since you sent me down, Mr. Page. Actually, in that moment, I did not prevail. So I suppose we're talking to a ghost. Funny you should put it like that, Jack. Because when I woke up... Uh, from the dead? There was silence all around me. I could swear to God I saw Billy then. Billy who? Billy the kid. William Bonney. He was shooting at me from a rooftop. Titched in the head. Mr. Greaves, perhaps we should switch you to coffee? You see that old Indian again, too? No, but I did see Billy's killer. Patrick <clears throat> Floyd Garrett. He came at me guns and blazing. Oh, we gave me uh... But I knew <laughs> that old war horse had died two years before. I wondered if maybe I was dead too and confronting the ghosts of my past. Perhaps all my sins were coming back to haunt me and, and drag me down to perdition. I saw Henry Plummer throw dynamite at me. But in the gates of the cemetery, I saw John Wesley Hardin, just like I remembered him.
Robert Ollinger appeared with his terrible double barrel shotgun. <laughs> Ghost Army was stopping me. Uh, my father-in-law got hit with a fallen branch. He spent the rest of his life talking to dogs. Newman Hayes Clanton, William Brocious, John Peters Ringo, they all wanted me dead. Newman Hayes Clanton, William Brocious, John Peters Ringo, they all wanted me dead. of the Garden of the Dead. Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry, both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. <laughs> Jesse, Woodson, James, and Jim Reed, each one deader than the next. I thought I would go crazy. Thought. The Dalton brothers, brothers, Robert and Grant, oh, guardians of the Garden of the Dead. George Curry and Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry. Both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. <laughs> En difficile, je me demande, euh, il doit pas en avoir beaucoup qui y arrivent. 
The Dalton brothers, Robert and Grant, guardians of the Garden of the Dead. The Dalton brothers, Robert and Grant, guardians of the Garden of the Dead. George Curry and Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry, both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. Jesse, Woodson, James, and Jim Reed, each one deader than the next. I thought I would go crazy. Thought? The Dalton brothers, Robert and Grattan, guardians of the Garden of the Dead. George Curry and Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry, both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. Jesse, Woodson, James, and Jim Reed. Each one deader than the next. The Dalton brothers, Robert and Grattan, Impossible. guardians of the Garden of the quoi. Dead. Curry and Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry, both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. <sighs> Jesse, Woodson, James, and Jim Reed, each one deader than the next. I thought I would go crazy. Thought. The Dalton brothers, Robert and Grattan, guardians of the Garden of the Dead. George Curry and Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry, both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. The Dalton brothers, Robert and Grant, guardians of the Garden of the Dead. George Curry and Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry, both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. Jesse, Woodson, James, and Jim Reed, each one deader than the next. <sighs> Ah. 
Finally, I saw Harry Alonzo Longaval. The Sundance Kid? Like a general leading his legion of the dead. You no, told us before that you'd seen him alive. He was alive. <sighs> Quand il met un coup de canon à travers la tombe. Ça va pas me dire que je vais penser là quand même. Si Tire de balle, t'éclate. Allez, on charge pas aussi. Then I heard a voice call to me from afar. It was Robert Leroy Parker, aka Butch Cassidy, coming at me from out of the fog. Thanks for taking care of that bastard. But the kid wasn't quite deceased. Not yet. It takes more than one little bullet to kill the likes of me, partner. Those two looked like they hadn't seen each other for quite a while. Clearly, they were no longer amigos. Shit. I was hoping I wouldn't have to kill you. You won't have to, Butch. I'm killing you first. I asked him about Bob Bryant. But they were too busy with their own heated conversation. Let me get this shit straight. You want my money and the love of my life? You frittered it all away, Butch. That is mine. And so is that damn money. I didn't want to shoot anybody until I had an answer to my question. But those boys didn't give me much of a choice. Dommage, j'avais le premier.
Même pas le temps de dégainer quoi. Oh là là. C'est pénible hein. Pénible. Ah, on va finir par y arriver hein, c'est sûr. Pourquoi il reste bloqué à droite Il reste bloqué à droite On va pas y arriver hein, s'il reste bloqué à droite. Hein. Surtout que c'est très compliqué pour moi là, je suis à la manette alors euh, faire 4 trucs en même temps, euh, c'est vraiment compliqué. Pas y arriver hein. oh là là, je suis désolé les gars désolé oh, je suis vraiment nul hein. ah. oh. je vais passer une heure à, à, à y arriver il faut que je reste focalisé sur un hein, parce que si je vais sur l'autre euh, j'arrive pas quoi un petit peu de chance quand même s'il vous plaît Je comprends pas. Il tire dessus, ça lui fait rien du tout. En fait, fallait tirer sur l'autre. C'est impressionnant. Quoi. Ah, le jeu, il est vraiment mal fait. Il y a des choses qui sont vraiment mal faites. Quoi. Le jeu, c'est vraiment dommage. Alors ça c'est vraiment euh, au point noir euh, du jeu en fait. C'est ce qu'il faut pas se dire normalement. Hein. Il faut se dire on va y arriver, il euh, faut se motiver, euh, mais ah je crois que c'est moi qui comprends pas ou. J'avais tiré Pourquoi elle est pas partie là-bas là Oh Je vais m'arracher la tête. Hein. Je vais m'arracher la tête. Quoi. Impressionnant. Et en plus, t'es obligé de le faire, quoi. Sinon, on t'avance plus dans le jeu. 
est coincé dans le jeu, tu pourras même pas le terminer. Allez, regarde-moi. Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid died there in that cemetery not six months ago. Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid were killed by the Bolivian Army. Everybody knows that. That's the legend, but it ain't the truth. So, uh, you never found Bob? There is no Bob. This old bitch ain't even Silas Grease. Sir, is that true? Have you been pulling our legs this whole time? Well, not the whole time. Oh, man, I think you've worn out your welcome here. Oh, Maybe you're right, here. Jack. Maybe it's time to pay. You see, Ben, or should I say Bob, your past always catches up with you. I, I was a different man back then, crazy, drinking. I, I changed my ways, I swear to you. If I could turn back the clock, I... But you can't, Bob. Why'd you toy with me like that? Telling those tales, knowing all along. Why not just lay your cards on the table? Here. I won't have it said that I left you with nothing. That's how you want it? So be it. Holy shit! Mullet, move against that wall. Go! Oh, my God! Oh, Jesus! Did you know it was him all along? Cassidy told me Bob was in Abilene before he died. But I wasn't sure Ben was my man until he revealed how much he knew about Ringo and Reed. The coin, of course. Well, that was the last nail in that particular coffin. I better go get the sheriff. You okay, boy? You look a mite shook up. Uh, Dwight, maybe you best go home. Uh, young Eisenhower here is leaving for West Point tomorrow. Uh, he shouldn't get caught up in something like this. I think I might head out myself at this juncture. Unless you want to stop me, Jack. No, sir, huh, Mr. Greaves. So where are you going now? Now that you had your revenge? Doesn't really matter, does it? As I have sold my soul for it, and will never again walk with those I have lost. Fini le jeu. Mis euh, deux jours pour le faire. Petit jeu, hein. Deux conseils quand même. Il est pas mal, voilà. Ah, là, il y a quelques trucs qui sont. Voilà. Moi qui galère un peu sur les duels. Non, euh, le reste. Euh, 
sympa, sympa à jouer. Vous pouvez faire des défis avec les collègues, euh, et tout ça. Un jeu que je conseille, qui est plutôt cool. Allez les potos, à plus